Superheroes are awesome, but without powerful supervillains to fight, they'd all be out of a job. Whether they use deadly weapons, dark magic, mind games, or powers of their own, there's no denying that these supervillains are not to be messed with. Here's CBR's most dangerous supervillains from comic book movies. Apocalypse. The Marvel Universe may be old, but Apocalypse is actually 5,000 years older. This shape-shifting supervillain is a master of alien technology and is the leader of the Alliance of Evil, the Horsemen of the Apocalypse, and the Dark Rider. Now that's one hell of an evil resume. With super strength rivaling the Hulk's flight, teleportation, and many more powers still left as mystery, this is one dangerous supervillain you don't want to piss off. Kingpin. Nothing fuels the rage of a supervillain like a childhood riddled with bullying and abuse. Wilson Fisk, aka the Kingpin, has proven to be one of the most brilliant and ruthless victim term crime bosses the comic book world has ever seen. Without any weapon at all, the Kingpin prefers to take a more hands-on approach to his murder and mayhem. While he may not have any superpowers, you have to give credit to any villain who can list Spider-Man and Daredevil as heroes he has given a beating to. Killer Croc. Have you ever thought, I like crocodiles, but I wish they were more dangerous? Yeah, us neither. Supervillain Killer Croc combines the animalistic qualities of a crocodile with superhuman strength, healing powers, bulletproof skin, and... Oh yeah, he's also a notorious cannibal. While he may not be the brightest croc in the pond, his willingness to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with anyone at any time certainly makes up for it. Even if I was a member of the Suicide Squad, this is one supervillain that I would stay far away from. Loki. Famous for taking on his brother Thor and the rest of the Avengers, Loki is one supervillain sorcerer that is not to be messed with. Loki makes quick work of his foes with his superhuman strength, powerful magical abilities, and resistance to injury and disease. As if messing with other beings isn't enough, Loki has the power to create rifts between dimensions and even push powers into other objects or creatures. Magneto. Surely we couldn't skip over our magnetic field creating slash bending mutants. Jumping the line from villain to hero to villain, you think Magneto's favorite pastime is double dutch. Either way, Magneto has been a pain in the side of the X-Men for quite some time. Having grown up in some terrible times, they convinced him humans are horrible people. Since Charles Xavier and his X-Men believe in human slash mutant peace, the struggle between conflicting ideologies is what sets the two men and sides apart. I've more than once wished that I had Magneto's powers to, let's say, move the cars around to get that perfect parking spot. Venom. More than one person has donned the Venom name due to the Venom symbiote finding different hosts to bond to. The symbiote's intention is to take over both the mind and body of its host, so when, for instance, it came into contact with Spider-Man obsessed and angry Eddie Brock, the symbiote became corrupt, giving Eddie superhuman strength, speed, and stamina alongside his Spidey-like powers. It's kind of like Popeye's spinach in a black gooey, liquidy kind of way. Venom's abilities allow himself to send frequencies that would block Spider-Man's spidey sense, giving him the upper hand on the friendly neighborhood web slinger. Lex Luthor. Genius, billionaire, idealist. Lex Luthor remains Superman's greatest arch nemesis. In the absence of superpowers, Luthor's greatest strength lies within his reputed chrome dome. His ideas, mixed with the fact that he can gain access to mostly anything with his wealth, has kept him a supervillain mainstay within the DCEU. The perfect dichotomy between Lex Luthor and Superman can only be compared to another supervillain coming up. The Joker. No one knows his story, but everyone knows his name. Joker. Without any superpower, super weapon, or even backup, Joker's calculated mayhem hasn't just made him a comic book icon, but one of the most complicated and terrifying villains in history. Not bad for a guy with nothing but a knife, a haunting laugh, and a truly villainous plan. Diblish clown prince of crime. What if I only had a nickel for every time he's baffled us? Did we miss any of your favorite comic book movie supervillains? Do some of them not belong on this list at all? Let us know in our comments section, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos like this one.